ago when we bought Storm, I was dreamed of a time when they'd be able to stay out all night. So I wanted our horses to always be able to stay outside when the weather was nice and never have to go in a stall. And last night was the first night that we left all four of our horses out. Side. and now we're gonna go down and see how they managed make sure everybody's okay and acknowledge another dream realized guys and welcome to today's video tomorrow is the day that our vet comes gives Finn and Willow booster shots and then it's all about Stella Stella's gonna get reevaluated and we're gonna get to see where she's at with her hawk and her weight loss and what we can do to help her whoa horses are eating this is another dream I wanted to be able to come down give them their grain in here and then oh there's Hendrix and then throw them hay and be done last night when I went to bed I felt so amazing at the fact that it was a gorgeous night outside and, and all four of our horses were outside chilling and hanging out for the whole entire night we have to watch Willow with so we're never looking back from this everybody's alive and happy as far as I'm concerned from now on all these horses are gonna be out all night and we're gonna be making our paddocks bigger and changing things up and they're gonna have more opportunities and I am excited I'm so excited for the growth of this little farm the big thing that I was worried about Stella's like me, let's go get out of here. I don't want any of this shenanigans. Finn's like, what do you, what, it wasn't my fault. Like, it wasn't me. He tried to steal his grain. He did. Finn, you tried to steal his grain. You deserve that. I know. Come on, Chubby, go out there. I'm going to bring no. you some hay. Uh oh, it's going to happen again. Stella's like, they're all circling. It's a storm. So, the storm gives him so much warnings before he does that. Yeah. He takes his, like, throws his head up and pins his ears, then goes back to you. And Finn's like, I'm still going to steal your grain like this. Finn sometimes does not make good choices. Oh, he always does. Finn, watch out, Kevin. This is fine. Storm's going to. Right. Yeah, well, I don't like people being taken out in the process. Yeah. That's a better decision. No, he always does that. And I know. I'm saying to Finn. It. I'm telling you, Finn, a better decision on Finn's part. That's your bucket. That's great. I feel so good that our horses stayed out all night. Oh, so um, these little rubber made, these little rubber buckets, the horses love them. It's better than this big, huge one. They always drink those ones first, no matter where I put them. Watch. <laughs> He's like, just let me sneak some. <laughs> He's such a cutie. It's <laughs> been like, it's worth the risk. Finn doesn't learn. Finn doesn't learn. Like, like he's eight. Uh oh, watch out! It's getting bad. Aww. Oh, not. Ooh, ooh, love bites. No, he been deserves it. Finn, you need to move. Aww. Oh, Stella? No? Okay. Everybody loves Stella, huh? Look at, we're all standing up against the wall. I'm not. You're like, <gasps> Yeah, I'm, yeah, man. Any That's you. right. I can't fall if I'm being. Finn, uh. He's a sensitive soul. You're a beautiful soul. And Storm is such a good horse. Yeah, he puts everybody in line. Willow beating up Finn. Willow, Finn, shut up! 
And look at him, he's like, don't even think about it. But that's the thing about Stella, she has a good brain. She, she she's waiting for he... permission. Yes. Last night I came outside and was uh, cleaning the back paddock. Now that the horses are outside and not in their stalls, um, we it, will be spending our time cleaning like the paddocks and instead of the stalls. But yeah, I'm so happy, so happy that the horses were able to stay out all night. So many dreams come true every single day. It's just incredible. The standoff is still going over poor Storm's grain. Because Poor Storm. I love all of our colors. Mom, look. Yeah, he, he's. Yeah. So he, Finn bites, like pushes it, and then he bites it, and he pulls it to him. Ah. God, let me get out of the way. Hey! Jesus! <laughs> she would have backed up on you. I oh, know. But, just... you're, but you were right behind her, so she was like, oh crap, can't run those. I people. try to come through here. Stella's like, it's almost gone. He's not letting me have any. Poor, poor Storm. Storm, you gotta be faster, dude. Well, look at Finn. like a movie for us. We're all just like hanging out in the barn watching our horses. It's because they all have like one grain. Ooh, he's gonna get it again. Finn finally gets his just rewards. This is why we should Stella. Stella. All that we have is each other now. I promise I won't leave your side. Be who you are and you'll be enough. If you're giving me your love, giving me your love. All that we have is each other now. I promise you won't leave my side. Not too bad. <laughs> Good boy, Finn. He's our troublemaker. He's our. Should we back her into a corner? Finn, you're fine. Yeah, so that medicine, I can already tell, is making a little bit of a difference in her. But she's definitely calmer. You're okay. <laughs> So, I messed up the vet's coming today. We're gonna do a big, huge thing. What if we put Stella, Stella. in stall so that they can both see You're her. gonna run with Stella, so go get Stella. And where's your dad? He needs to take Finn back. So, Finn had his shots, now he's gonna have strangles, and Stella's gonna get strangles. She's already getting stressed out. Stella, you, Willow, I mean. Willow, you did so good with your shot this time. Last time she dragged us across the, dragged me across the room. Oh yeah, he doesn't like this one. Do you want me to help? No, 
<laughs> so funny. Tell me what, what you want to do. I'll do anything. As long as I can be here with you, everything's all right. uncomfortable again let's just inject that joint oh that's what i wanted to talk about should we inject the joint yeah, maybe, maybe that we do that route instead i uh, love that route of instead of keeping her on the mat, yeah just like let's pull her off see how she does if she stays like this i think i would leave her alone okay um because exercise is probably going to keep her the most comfortable and keeping okay. her moving yeah um just make sure that she gets good warm up before yeah. before riding. Gabby and Fiona are the warm up queens of the world. Um, and and if she seems like she takes a step backwards, then we should just go ahead and inject that. Uh -huh. She's in yeah. you know better shape than she's been. And, yeah. Um, so I think that's what. So I the the hawk is likely not fused yet completely. Uh, very unlikely. Okay. It takes a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we're going to take her off the meds. Yep. Fiona will be monitoring the whole thing. So yep. she'll tell me the minute that yeah. if she and needs I mean, to. If, if she feels like she's off when she's been being ridden, if she feels any different, then that's a sign too that, oh, yeah. you know, that she's, she's not as comfortable. So I think when you're riding her, you're going to hopefully notice that she's feeling the same or feeling yeah. you know, not as comfortable, or maybe she's not as willing to do something that yeah. you're wanting her to do. Those mm -hmm. would all be signs that, um, that we're, you know, we're not as happy as we were yeah absolutely yeah so basically what he said was that we're going to take Stella off her prevacox we're not going to give it to her anymore we're going to watch she said that she's still a little bit off in that same thing her her hawk's definitely not fused completely she's doing 100 percent better she's improving she's in the best shape that he's ever seen her um she's going in the right direction we're going to take her off the prevacox if she stays the same for any of you guys who don't know the Prevacox is like a pain medication. She's been on it for a while now. Um, I'm excited to have her off of it. So we're going to take her off of it. We're going to watch and we're going to see if she doesn't want to do what she's been doing. If she seems resistant to riding, if she seems like she's in pain, if she's limping more, like if she seems off, if like a lot of things, if any of those things happen, we're going to call him and he's gonna come back and he's gonna inject her hawk, which I'm excited about. Like, I just wanna give her relief and I think the injection's gonna make a big difference. He doesn't wanna rush it, he wants to make sure that she, if she doesn't need it, she doesn't need it. And that's okay, but I think, like, I'm excited. So he said the Prevacox is gonna stay in her system for a short time, like one week, maybe two weeks, and then after that we'll start to see a difference in her, a change in her, so yeah. I'm excited, like, I love that visit, like, I love them. Finn and Willow got their, uh, got their boosters and their strangles vaccine. Oh, and Willow, so, and about Willow, so we started her on the ulcer guard and it's changed her a lot she's a lot different a lot better a lot easier to manage when he gave her her shot she last time she it was way worse she seems a lot better she seems a lot more settled we're gonna watch her for a couple of days if she actually has a reaction and starts to do that ulcer like she gets a bellyache after a stressful situation which is why we are um which is why we're pretty sure she has ulcers if she does it again then we all know that the stuff that we're supplement we're giving her isn't healing her ulcers um 
and we'll start her on a metrazole heal her ulcers and then she'll always take something either all the time to calm her down so she doesn't get ulcers or we'll give her something when during stressful situations so yeah got it all under control guys Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.